So, how long have you been drifting? Hard to say. Uh, you lose track of time out there, you know? So, uh, where'd you get your gear? Ammo. Well, there's a couple of camps I used to do runs for. Bounty hunting, mostly. Freaks? Or men? Both. I had a reputation for being able to track shit down, you know? Uh, which camps? Where are they? You know, past the Farewell Valley. It doesn't matter. They're gone now. They're overrun. Uh, Russell said you were there when Silver Lake was overrun. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was a shit show, I can tell you. Uh, any survivors? A few. Why are you not working hard? Why are you still in my obstacle course? Here. Take this. Militia script. Camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? I can recruit you. But the colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. Jesus. Jesus, motherfucker has my ring. He took it from Sarah. He had to take it from Sarah because she wouldn't have given it to him. So that means that she's got to be here. He doesn't look like militia. Move, move, move! Come on! You can run faster than that. My dead grandma can run faster than that. My dead crippled grandmother who was in a goddamn... That's it for now. Working hard. Why are you still in my obstacle course? Why are you not finished hey. with my obstacle course? Hey. Do you like it that much? Do you want to run it again? New around here. Name's Ava Bergstrom. Princess. Friends call me Bergie. Deacon St. John. Yeah, I, I just got here. Well, Deacon St. John, you do your job and we'll get along just fine. How's that? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Is that all you need? Okay. Later. Hey, hey there. Hello. Go, go, go! You gotta move your ass! You think you're gonna outrun the freaks? Hell no, you're not! Hey. Uh, you don't look very militia to me. No, um, man. Name's Wade. Wade Taylor. You can call me Wade. Deacon St. John. <laughs> Holy Listen. shit! Deacon St. John, is your old man a preacher or something? No. Man, that is a hell of a name. All right, listen. You wait. see this, man? This is some crazy shit. Yeah. Whew. So what, you joining up, becoming an army man, you playing soldier and shit? I don't know, maybe. Listen, <laughs> uh, you look like you just came in from out the shit, right? Yeah, man, yesterday. Okay. Yesterday. I've been, I've been waiting to see the colonel, whatever the hell that is. Traveling with some people, we got separated. You see anyone that looked like this around here? Uh, nah, man. Ooh, she is a looker. I'd hit that, you know. <laughs> uh, I gotta go, man. They're checking me for lice or some shit. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Jesus, what a name. Jesus, that dude's fucked up. He wouldn't remember Sarah if she slapped him in the face. <sighs> Come on, Sarah. Come on. Where the hell are you? You're here. Somewhere. Maybe in these tents. Maybe in here. Nope, not here. It's 
check this one. The infirmary. I mean, with her background, that's where she would be, right? <clears throat> oh, damn it. She's not here either. That's got to be the one. Sarah? Sarah, you in here? Shit, not here. Oh, God damn it, she's not here. She's not here, but... Right, yeah, it yeah, couldn't be that easy. Not could it? St. John, are you on this channel? Corporal Russell said you had a radio. Yeah, yeah, uh, I'm here. Meet me at the gate. On my way. Getting ready to ride out. You still coming? Ready when you are. So you put a lot of work into this. Yeah, some. I mean, it looks like a forest fire, but the stumps are charred. So that means, that means that the timber was cut before it was burned. You got a good eye. We call it the dead zone. We use the timber to build our barricades, then burn the slash. From the outpost, we can see a horde coming long before it reaches us. And what? You're gonna burn all the buildings, too, so the newts and the swarmers have nowhere to sleep? Do you know you're freaks, huh? Like I said, I've been out in the ship for a long time. So that's your plan, huh? The militia, I mean, to burn everything to the ground? We're fighting a war out here, St. John. To do whatever it takes to win. A war? That's what it is, isn't it? A war? You've been out in this shit. You've seen the hordes. The only thing that's gonna stop them is an army. Our army. It's gonna take way more than an army. We have a plan. The colonel lets you join. We'll fill you in. Hello, oh, Silver Lake. You asked about survivors. Someone? No. No, not really. I mean, look, there were some folks that I rode with once and I thought maybe they ended up there. Uh, I thought maybe you were after someone. For a bounty, I mean. Yeah, no. I tracked men over long distances before, but not this far. No bounty's worth that. Done, sir. Make sure you make a marker. Yes, sir. All right. You two head back to Diamond Lake. Grab, uh, Taylor was his name? Yes, sir. Yeah. Take him to the Colonel. I'll be there in 1800. Sir? Military time, Corporal. You're supposed to know this by now. Oh, yes, sir. Get the fuck out of here. Yes, sir. You find something? Uh, how long is, uh, Vasquez? How long has Vasquez been with you guys? A couple of weeks, maybe more. <laughs> well, he's been busy. What the hell? You guys been having trouble with supply runs, marauder attacks? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go on foot from here. On foot? Why? <laughs> because Vasquez came out here for a reason. I can't track him from the bike. Where do we start? It's been snowing, so uh, there won't be any boot prints. Come on, I want to look inside the cabin. Okay, I'm following you.
You, uh, <clears throat> you said he stole rations? Ammo? Yes. This is an MRE. It's half-eaten, so looks like your men rode up on him when he wasn't expecting it. His bike's still out front, which means that he went out the back. I got a use for you. Wait, over here. What'd you find? The fence has been cut. And the rust. So it was cut recently? Yeah, come on, this way. Hey, hold on for a second. Look. Over here. Tracks? Uh, yeah, we're in luck. something? Yeah, shell casing. Recently fired. He, uh, well, he stopped to shoot at something. Come on, down here. Get out of here! What are you doing? That ever work for you? Yelling at a- Look out! More wolves! I see him! Right on target. the last of them. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like it. Nice work.
Yeah, worth some credits. I want to take a look at this thing. Looks like the MREs weren't enough for your man. Clean gunshot, right through the head. Yeah, the wolves must have heard the shot. Decided they wanted it more than Vasquez. Yeah, the rest of the pack came at us from back that way, from the east. You think they chased off Vasquez, leaving one to guard the carcass? That's my guess. Come on, let's see if you're right. You guys got a lot of wolves out here? Ones that aren't infected, I mean? Yeah, we get reports almost every day. When I was a kid, growing up, there were no wolves in Oregon. I mean, a few coyotes, but no wolves. They've been driven to extinction by ranchers and farmers, timber companies. Well, it looks like they're making a big comeback. Hold up, hold up, hold up. What is it? It's a backpack. It's one of ours. Looks like they almost got to him. And he shrugged off the pack to get away. No, no, no. To buy time. He landed on his ass. Tried to scramble away, but then the wolf lunged. Vasquez dropped him. Two shots. You can tell all that. Yeah. Wait, get down. A swarm. Near our gravesite. I don't think this one is marked on our map. They're scattered all over the region. Yeah, well, maybe that explains why uh, Vasquez came through here. Let's go around. Exactly what I was thinking. Is it John? This one. Yeah, right there with you. I gotta say, they're getting tired of running and hiding from these sons of bitches. You ever take on a swarm? Yeah, I've done it before. This is gonna keep moving. Look, you're gonna join the militia? We must stay focused on the mission. We're not out here to fight freaks. Being in the shit, killing freaks, kinda goes hand in hand, doesn't it? Okay, um, put some distance between us and the graves. The cold weather's gonna bring out even more of them. I think they can smell the corpse from about a mile out. Part of our slash and burn strategy is to find these grave sites, dig them up, and burn them along with everything else. Yeah, well, good luck with that. I've seen hundreds of them. It's just in this part of the state alone. You've got to start somewhere. All right, where now? Keep heading east. Hey, there's a road ahead. Hold up a second. What do you think? Is anyone else tracking him? Not that I know of. Huh. Well, then he's either dead, or he's got a lot of friends. You see how his tracks have been overridden by bikes. A lot of bikes. Hmm. Okay. Come on. Let's see where they're heading. You said cold weather brings out the freaks? Yeah, yeah. Cold, snow, rain, hell, even clouds. Well, like I said before, you know your freaks. When we get to command, there's some people who want to talk to you. People? The Colonel will fill you in, if he lets you join. Yeah, yeah I think you said that already. Look, he runs a tight outfit. I just don't want you to get your hopes up. Hey, don't worry about me. I don't really give a damn either way.
hear that? Yeah, it's coming from the logging camp over there. Is that on your map? Yeah. Wow, oh, that means it's also on Vasquez's map. Come on. If Vasquez is there, what would your strategy be? Well, he's not alone. We know that from the tracks. What's that militia penalty for going AWOL? Hanging by the neck until dead. Why? Well, it means Vasquez isn't coming without a fight. See your man? Yeah. That's him. Well, looks like you guys need to start doing background checks on your recruits. He seems to be right at home. Well, let's wait here. I'll radio for backup. Get your goddamn hands off me! Oh, oh this one's a fighter, boys! What do you think? Oh, see about that. Oh, hell no. What? Uh, I just got this problem with assholes who hurt unarmed women. I'm giving you an order. Order? You see me wearing a red armband? You don't give me orders yet. You do whatever the hell you want.
rest of them. I think so. Nice work. Come on, let's go deal with your man. Vasquez? He isn't my man. Not anymore. Wait here. Stand guard in case we missed anyone. You can handle him? He won't know what hit him. Yeah, this is it. I can get in through here. Wait! Whoa, 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 whoa! Easy, easy. I'm not gonna... I'm just here to help. I don't need your goddamn help. Okay. I'm just gonna move over here. with them you think i give a damn who you are okay okay We brought up your bikes, Captain. Thought we'd save you the walk back. That'll be all, Corporal. So how'd I do? Did I pass? Pass? Oh, you've been watching me all day. I figured this was what? Some kind of test. <laughs> no. Nothing quite as formal as all that. As you can see, our pool of recruits isn't what it used to be. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. You passed. Oh, you ready to meet the colonel? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why the hell not? 